morning, we're waking up to around 57 degrees. It cooled off a bit yesterday. Yeah, let's check in with KIMT Storm Team 3 meteorologist Sean McAday. So, Sean, we had a cooler day yesterday. How are we looking today? I think today is going to be a great day to get outside and uh, soak it in, right? Here's my favorite number today for you, the dew point. The dew point is below 60 degrees. When we talk about the dew point, when it gets above 60, it typically starts to feel humid or sticky. Right now, we're a little bit below 60 and we're still falling. We could get into the 40s this afternoon. That is dry, especially for July. It's going to feel crisp today. It already does out the door right now. Actual temperatures, because we have less humidity, less water in the air to hold on to some of that heat, temperatures have fallen into the 50s as well across most of the area. That's a nice change of pace from yesterday when we started off in the mid-60s. Instead, today you can give your AC a break, open up those windows, and let the breeze in. Clean air moving in, clear skies. It's going to be great the next couple of days as high pressure moves in from the west. This morning, I bet you some folks will opt for the hot cup of coffee as you're stepping out the door or at the drive through or you're at work, whatever you're doing. It makes sense because it's not crazy hot yet. In fact, most of the morning is going to be in the 60s, even through lunchtime, only 68 degrees. This afternoon, we do make it to the 70s, and it's a great afternoon to hit some of our county fairs. we got a lot of them going on. we got the North Iowa Fair. We have the Winnebago County Fair, the, the Floyd County Fair, the, what am I missing? Uh, I think the Dodge County Fair and the Fillmore County Fair, all going on right now. This afternoon, one of the better ones so far this week to do that. And if you can't this afternoon, no worries, because we also have tomorrow and Friday. Tomorrow, probably a better day for the pool, honestly. Today, with highs only in the low 70s, dare I say it feels a little bit chilly for a pool, you know, especially considering there will be a bit of a breeze today, 10 miles per hour, not that windy, but enough where, you know, low, between that and the low 70s, not the best pool weather. Tomorrow, though, no breeze, 75. I think that's going to be great for sitting poolside. Same thing on Friday as well. Just be sure to lather up that sunscreen. It's going to be very sunny the next, not one, not two, but the next three days straight. It's just sunshine as far as you can see. Tomorrow you're going outside for a walk. This is exactly what I was talking about. Low winds. Look at this. Barely anything there. So today's a good day for a run, but so will tomorrow. And so will Friday. Friday will be back into the mid to upper 70s. A touch warmer, but still pretty nice. Same thing Saturday, but Saturday finally that humidity. It's starting to creep upwards a little bit, and that's going to increase our chances for some rain. There's a small chance we could see a raindrop Saturday afternoon, but the chances are much better Sunday afternoon for actually seeing a, a quick little storm pop up. That'll be something we keep an eye on the next couple of days, but still, I don't think it would cancel your plans uh, too much on Sunday. Best chance this week for rain does look to be early next week on Monday when we return to 80 degrees. All right. Thank you, Sean. A federal appeals court.